guys on again today, excited about it. Um, team runs, some contact periods. But I'm um, you know, happy with the way the offense is working, learning. Younger guys are coming along, so we'll make progress. Who are some of the younger guys that are sticking out and why? Uh, see, I commented a few days ago on uh, the other receiver, Pickens and, and, and Calvin's done a good job. And, you know, I think Miles Boykins has stepped up and taken a lot of his reps with some of the older guys getting banged up. And, uh, Big body is a good target. Um, so, kid from Oklahoma State, got to give him a shout out. Jalen Warren's done a good job running the ball physically, catching catching balls out of the backfield and in protection as well. You said you're happy with some of the younger guys. What about you? Are you happy with how you've been out there? Yeah, I think there's always things that you want to get better at, clean up. I'm never going to be satisfied. Um, but I'm, yeah, I'm happy with. Uh, I think uh, Coach talks about getting, you know, getting new problems. I think you, learn, you make a couple mistakes and you, and you learn from it and you move on, but I'm happy with the way, yeah, I think, I think uh, taking steps forward from year five, it's what I would expect. Mason, how different is Anthony Miller to you than when he first joined? Yeah, he, I, think, I think just uh, mentally, just from a playbook perspective, he's had more time. He's had a full training camp to, um, you know, with, with Matt and, and to learn and to ask questions. And he's, he's, in, the, he's in the right place. At the right time, that's that's what we look for. He's obviously very athletic, and he, he makes he, he runs well with the ball in his hands after contact. So. How much like is the Deontay and Chase out there? But to have these rookie receivers getting these reps, how vital is that for them? You learn with them, and they adapt. To yeah, uh, it's important. I think uh, obviously we we, we want to have Chase and Deontay back to us, Pat, Najee as soon as possible. But uh, you know they, they're they're stepping up and they're doing they're doing well. With the reps that they're, you know, they've been given. So, How much is the quarterback team? rotation? What you guys have been doing? I mean, you mix up like yesterday. Mitch take two, you take two, kind of yeah. alternating like that. How does that help you or help the development of this competition as a whole? I think it just keeps you light on your feet. You got to adjust all the time and uh, be able to, you know, um, create your own kind of groove. Whether it's two reps or, or you get the full rack of four. Just, just makes you a better player, makes you more light on your feet. Did they tell you before practice yesterday, like, hey, we're going to do this tornado switch kind yes, of thing? They, did. they didn't say tornado, but they, <laughs> did, say they did say that. Yeah. With, with the days George has been able to stack up, does that give you more of an indication he might be someone that can really help you guys? For sure. We, we expect, I mean, he, he expects himself yeah. to. He, he, he holds, he's uh, very hard on himself. He's, he's, a, he's a hungry young player, and, and I think he's got a bright future. Mason, is it hard to evaluate maybe what you guys have been doing on offense, you personally too, not having some of your key guys out there, not having Chase, Deontay, uh, Najee, Pat, missing a lot of guys, a lot of key guys? Yes, yes, but I think sometimes that's even more important from an evaluation standpoint. I mean, I know it's a bigger challenge as a quarterback to, to make it work, to move the ball, to move the chains with, with when you're not working with the guys that you've got phenomenal chemistry with. So it's just a ch another challenge, another another way you can, um, yeah, just something else to overcome. Yeah, I think we've done that. Young, younger guys have stepped up. So. You wanted that the, heat's starting to, starting to feel that grind a little bit. The is, heat. So. The heat and all that. <laughs> not, as, not as bad as the big boys. I'm, I'm, I'm lucky. The position I play, they're, they're feeling a little more than I am. So got to keep them hydrated. You're one of the few people that have been around for this Friday night lights event that's coming up tomorrow what you know what do you think is it is it good to have something like that also to break up camp because it's been long before you get to that first preseason game. yeah it's it's a you know it takes you back to high school the whole uh set up and the fans and the stands and and uh you know the friday night lights so it'll be fun it's something i look forward to that we sign autographs there before practice so um yeah it, it breaks it up a bit but it's it's also fun Kind of takes you back. How do you now, evaluate your personality compared to Mitch and Kenny? Um, forget who Pat said that you're more talkative and outgoing. But how does that quarterback room? How do you kind of evaluate the other guys' personality? Personality. Wise? I'm not really trying to evaluate their personality. I think they've all got good personalities. I think uh, yeah. Mesh well and Chris, uh, Kenny, Mitch, they're all good dudes, and, and uh, we mesh well and work well together, make each other better. But I. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not trying to become a master psychologist of my quarterback room. Are you the most talkative out of the group? I don't or? know. I think that it's just, I don't know. I don't know if I'd say that at all. No, I think, I think maybe, maybe just because I know, because I'm, I'm, I've been here the longest, I've got a relationship with, with guys. Maybe that comes off as, but I've never tried to be a loud mouth. Just talk when, you know, speak, you know, when, when, when you need to speak. 
Yeah. Don't, don't know how much you've got to work with the other Mason, but what's he been like as a center? You know, he's the coolest the Mason. <laughs> <laughs> not you? No, not me. But he's, he's done a good job. He's a veteran player. He's a smart dude, great player, physical. 